And also, we are going to learn about uh, we are going to learn about the importance of water absorbent and non water absorbent material today. Okay, uh, can you show teacher thumbs up if you uh, still can see my screen? Can you see or not? Yes, can you see or not? Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. Okay. All right. Okay. Yes. 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 Can you see? <laughs> okay. Yes. 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 Uh, today we are going to learn about the importance of material that can absorb water and the one that cannot absorb water. Ah, okay. 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 All right. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay so before you want to see the sponge ball anymore? Ah, you don't want to see? Yeah, teacher. Teacher won't show you anymore because we already look at it before. Yeah, okay? I want to see the sponge ball. Ah, sponge ball. You already picked this. <laughs> It's so funny. I want to see. Want to see. So we already, we already I don't seen. Want, because it's all boring. Okay, I okay, want okay. It's not, it's not a uh, laughing. Ah, okay. It's okay. You don't have to laugh, alright. You don't have to laugh anymore because. Uh, I just to laugh. Teacher won't, <laughs> teacher won't show you anymore. Okay, ah, listen to teacher. Me too. I love to laugh. Yeah, 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 yeah. I will show you. Wait, wait. Turn off the microphone now. Ah. When, yeah. when I explain it, do not turn on your microphone, okay? Unless if teacher call your name or when I ask you a question, all right? So, for the topic absorption, we have learned about material that can absorb water, that can cannot absorb, uh, that cannot absorb water. But today, we are going to see, all right, why those material, why we need them in our daily life. Why we need material that can absorb water? Why we need material that cannot absorb water as well? Okay, uh, that is what we are going to learn today. Okay, so before this, all right, we already done the flower bloom experiment. Let's say if you didn't join our previous class, you can watch the re recorded the video. Flower. Uh -huh. uh, you can read, I can't teach you. Oh, paper. I don't have YouTube. The flower. Yeah. Okay, microphone off, please. Teacher. Microphone off, please. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, anyone want to go to the toilet or drink water? If you raise up your hand, if you want to go to the toilet or drink water, you may go. Okay, so this one we already done before. Okay, if you don't have the flower template, uh, kindly ask your parents to check the seesaw inbox. Teacher provide in your parents' seesaw inbox. Teacher, okay. can I can I tell my dad? Tell uh, what? Tell my dad about the flower bloom. Yes. Uh, later, later. After I have to do the. Okay. Experiment. Ah, okay. We already finished the experiment. Ah, this one we already done the experiment. Okay, so. Do you want to do? Ah, okay. Please turn off your microphone. Ah, let me uh, let let teacher be the only one who's talking. Okay, so that you can hear the sound clearly. Okay, so today we are going to look at the importance. Ah, what is the meaning of importance? Is why do we need them in our daily life? Ah, why do we need them? In our daily life. So the first one, we are going to look at the water absorbent object. Okay, water absorbent object. Okay, so Raid, Raid, can Raid turn on the microphone, Raid? Raid. 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 Okay, so okay, Hazik, can Hazik turn on the microphone? Hazik Imran? Yes, teacher. Okay, Hazik, what is this? This one, the blue color, what is this? Ah, his, uh, his mother used to wipe his hair and also his body. What is this? Start with T. Towel. Towel. Well done, Hazik. Thank you. Thank ah. you, teacher. You're welcome. Okay, so this one is towel. Ah, so towel teacher, is... Teacher? Mm-hmm. Teacher? Yes. 
Can water absorb water? Huh? Can water absorb water? No. Can hair absorb water? Can hair? Hair. 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 Our, yeah. Our, our, our hair. hair. Our hair? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. not. Can hair absorb water? Can hair absorb water? No. <laughs> Alright. So our hair. Uh, things, uh, our hair is made up from things we call it as uh, keratin. Keratin. Not. Okay. It's made up from keratin. So um, for us to say that hair can absorb water, our hair not exactly can absorb water uh, even if after you after you take your bath why your hair is dry because it's exposed to the air or uh, some of us they use hair dryer but our hair uh, don't really can absorb water even if there's water can go inside our hair only a little bit same goes to our skin same goes to our skin okay but but uh, not more than one liter is too many, but only a little bit. Only a little bit of water. Nanti yes. kalau mandi, nanti dia basah macam mana? Uh, but your hair, your hair did that. They cannot absorb you... so much water. Yeah, only a little. Yeah, when I shower and that, hmm. and then the water will come out from my hair. Yeah, the, the water will pass through, Teacher, right? Teacher, sometimes off. when I take a bath, and then when I'm that. done, hair. I don't, I don't, I don't like um use a towel to do that because mm -hmm. when I already done take a bath, it already dries. It's already dry. Okay, all right. Uh, so after I shower, <coughs> I'm not um my hair are late to dry. Mm, because you have a long hair, right? So those who have shorter hair, it's easier for them to dry. Okay, so now we are talking about the water absorbent. So, example of water absorbent that we use every day in our daily life is our towel. That's why uh, when your mommy or daddy want to buy a towel for you, they will choose the material that a good water absorbent. Okay, so that the water, it can easily absorb the water from your hair and also from your body. So I have a lot of towel. Okay, thank you for sharing. Please do not turn on your microphone, okay? Let teacher explain first. Okay, so this one, the first one, example of water absorbent material that we use every day in our daily life is our towel, okay? All right, next one. Uh, next one, water absorbent, the second object, okay? This one. Teacher, mm -hmm. I think I dapat vaccine for seven years old. Oh, okay, you already, you already uh, went to the clinic? Yeah, already yes. second dose. Okay, all right. Oh, Good job. Wool. Okay, this one is cotton wool. wool all right. Ah, it's cotton or, wool. Or you can call cotton bud. Cotton bud. Cotton bud is one. Wait, where? Cotton bud is one. Oh yeah, I yeah. forgot. Okay, but it's still made up from cotton. For hidung. Oh, oh hidung? yes. Oh, oh yes. I call it cotton yeah. ball. <laughs> Okay, because cotton. I look See? like a boy. Yeah, uh, yeah. We call them according to dress <gasps> shape. Okay. Uh, oh. one more, one more cotton. Uh, facial cotton, the square one. People use it to apply the skincare. So this, uh, please turn. I don't know what is that cotton wool. Uh, please turn off your microphone. So, um, mm -hmm. Turn off your microphone. Did you explain? So what is the meaning of the situation? Situation. Observe the, observe the situation means observe what is happening, things around us. What is happening? The situation happening. Okay, Ian? All right. So, now in this uh, picture, okay, this one, people use cotton wool to stop the uh, small amount of bleeding. Okay, for example, if you go for your vaccination, okay, they will use cotton wool after they inject, okay, to stop uh the blood from coming out okay uh, or to treat the wound okay so aside from water aside from water cotton wool can absorb things that in form of liquid as well what is the meaning of liquid it looks like water so like water okay our blood even though it's not exactly like water but it's in liquid form what is liquid form it looks like water Okay, that is the easiest way for you to 
uh, memorize. Uh, what is liquid? Uh, it's not like water. Okay. <coughs> Sorry. So, uh, this cotton wool we can use, okay, to treat uh, small injuries uh, because it can absorb the blood. Okay, so this one is the second example. All right, now the third one. Uh, the third one, this one. <clears throat> Arisa Zahra, can Arisa tell the teacher what is this, Arisa Zahra? Hey, teacher. What is this? This one. What is this? What do we call this? Mop. Mop, correct. Mop can absorb water or not, Arisa? Yes. Yes, good job. Thank you. Ah, so now this girl is using a mop, okay? A mop to clean the floor, right? So mop is one of the water absorbent material. So the next time you see the word water absorbent, mm -hmm. uh, you can try to memorize or teacher has said, water absorbent is the material that can absorb water, that can take water in. For example, if you spill water on the floor, you can use the mop, okay? To clean them, yes. Who did not turn off your microphone? Please turn off your microphone. Okay, uh, so the next situation we have a kitchen towel, okay, kitchen towel to clean the cup, right? So before your mommy or daddy, okay, wash the dishes, before we keep the cup and also the plate, right? We need to dry them first. Uh, we need to dry them first. So this one, the kitchen towel. Kitchen towel is the example of material that can absorb water. Ah, example of material that we call as water absorbent. Right? Water absorbent. Okay, Faik. Faik Muzakir. Can Faik turn on the microphone? Okay. Okay. Faik, what this boy is doing now, Faik? This boy is uh, no. wiping the towel at his head. Okay, wiping the towel at his head. Okay, so now he's wiping uh, his sweat, right? Ah, yes. thank, thank you, Fai. Okay, so now, right, uh, this boy is wiping. Fai, you can turn off the microphone. Thank you. Okay, good job. So now this boy is wiping his sweat, right? So, the material that he need to use to wipe his sweat, okay, must be a water absorbent material, right? You can use towel, you can use tissue, you can use a uh, handkerchief, all right? The material that can absorb water. Uh, that's the only way you can wipe your sweat, okay? So, next one. Uh, just now, we see a water absorbent material that can take water in, absorb water. Next one, we are looking at the non-water, Allahu Rabbi, non-water absorbent. Non-water absorbent is material that cannot absorb water. Ah, material that cannot absorb water. So now, okay, now we have here, ah, teacher have this one. Kisharos is here, not Kisharos? Yes, teacher. Yes, Kisha, what is this, this one? What is this? Umbrella. Umbrella. Thank you, Kisha. Good job. So this one is umbrella. So umbrella, your umbrella is the example of material that cannot absorb water, non-water absorbent. Okay, because umbrella, we need them to protect us from the rain. Uh, that's why we need our umbrella to be non-water absorbent. Uh, can you tell teacher what happened to us if our umbrella is Water absorbent, what will happen to us? Water will leak. Water will be wet. 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 When the water can pass through your umbrella, what is the point for you use to use the umbrella? Okay, for you to use the umbrella, so you will get wet. Okay, you will get wet. So that's why we need our umbrella. We need our raincoat to be non-water absorbent, so that it can protect us from the rain. Ah. This one, okay. This one, ah, the same like just now. Okay, same. Ah, this one umbrellas. 
But uh, this one have body shield. Uh, this one have body shield around him. Uh, body shield. Why? Because sometimes, sometimes if we use umbrella, okay, our shirt, okay, our shirt will still get wet when it's raining heavily, right? So some people, they will use this method, okay, they will use this type of umbrella to protect their clothes uh, from getting wet. Yes, uh, who raised up your hand? Teacher, I never see like the umbrella and like that. This one. This is the first time you see this one. Yes. Yes. Um. Uh. Many of people use uh this type of umbrella together with the body shield. Okay. Because sometimes when people want to go work, okay, people want to go to their work and also they have important meeting, so they want to avoid their clothes from getting wet. Right. For example, they have interview. Ah. Uh, uh, they want to go to a meeting, a big meeting. So they need uh, their clothes to be dry. Uh, okay. So they will use this one. They will use this method to protect their clothes from getting wet. Their hair. Okay. For the guy. I'm first time look at this umbrella before. Uh, I this just is... have a regular one. You have regular one. Teacher have a regular one as well. But before this, uh, I used to see some kids, they use umbrella with the body shield like this. Okay. So the material that, uh, please turn off the microphone, five, four, three, two, one, thank you. Okay, so the material for the shield is must to be non-water absorbent as well. Why? Because if your umbrella, if your umbrella is non-water absorbent, but the shield here is water absorbent, you will still get wet. So both of your umbrella and also the body shield need to be non-water absorbent. Okay, so that you can protect your body and yourself from rain. Ah, next one, next one, next one. Kena hujan nanti demam kan? Yes, <laughs> kena hujan nanti demam. Because mm -hmm. umbrella is made up from plastic, getah, or kain. Plastic, getah. Ah, uh, you you telling teacher or you asking teacher yeah? I asking. Ask teacher. Asking. Okay, so. Uh, for the umbrella, uh, clothes umbrella, most of the umbrella, uh, they didn't make, they didn't made up from clothes because clothes usually they are water absorbent. So we cannot make umbrella from clothes. Okay. So for this one, okay, this one, uh, this one, this one, this umbrella, okay. Uh, this umbrella is made up from plastic, but some other umbrella, okay. Some other umbrella, this one, this one, this uh, this material uh, is not made up from plastic. Uh, what do we call that? Uh, the material is quite thicker. Uh, if you see this one, plastic. Mm -hmm. It's plastic. You can see through, right? Uh, you can see through. And uh, this one, this uh, umbrella, okay, made up from material that are thicker. Thicker. Uh, lagi tebal, thicker. Okay, so for clothes cannot, umbrella cannot made up from clothes. Okay, so they usually made up from uh, plastic and also, uh, wait, teacher forgot uh, the other material that you they used to make umbrella. Later, teacher will check again. Eh? I will reconfirm for you. Okay. Okay, so this one, uh, this one we have boots here, right? We have boots. Okay, because sometimes even if you use the umbrella, your shoes will still get wet. Okay, so. As uh, for you to prevent your shoes from getting wet, you can use these boots to protect your yeah. shoes, mm, to protect your feet. Yes. Um, I always don't have that boot. Uh -huh. uh, I have that boot before uh -huh. when I go to Australia. Australia. So you have uh, this boot? Jamie has that, but it's uh, lion. Lion? A different yes. kind. Different kind of boot. Uh, boot Japan. Non, non water absorbance. Non water if absorbent. That, mm -hmm. If absorb later, our shoes and our pants will get wet. Yes, your feet will get wet as well, right? Ah, okay. Yes. So for boots, okay. Ah, uh, for boots, we have many many kind of boots. Some people, ah, uh, some people use boot for fashion. They just they just want to wear the boots for fashion to look uh for the boots to look good on themselves. But this boot, this one, the one that I'm showing you, is the boot to protect your feet from getting wet. Okay? Uh, so we have many types of boots. Some boots they use for fashion. 
but this one, the one that I'm sharing with you, is the boot that can protect your feet or your shoes from getting wet. Uh, so it's made up from water absorbent. Right? Okay, so next one. Ah, this one, the black one here, we call it as windshield. Okay, I'm sure you already saw them uh, in your parents' car. Okay, so we call it as windshield. <clears throat> Oh, yeah. that one. I yeah. know. I yeah. knew it. Uh, in the yeah. back. Of the I knew it. This one. This one. Mm. So, it's when. All yes. cars uh, have two, but some of them only have one. Yeah, uh, sometimes at the back, at the back. Uh, the back has one. At the back, I, I, I only have one. Yes. Uh, have you seen I, 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 I have two cars, and then he's saying. Ah, okay. Teacher, have you seen like my V and then there's mm -hmm. the cat picture on the uh, uh, mirror? At the back? At the back? Yeah, at the back and then there's the cat is on the mirror. It's just a white sticker and then ah. the tail is on the windshield. Ah, okay. <laughs> uh, did, you, did you have seen before? Because sometimes uh, those people don't want the other car at the back to follow them. To follow them okay near to each other to avoid any incident uh please turn off the microphone 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 off thank you okay so this windshield all right usually this windshield your parents will uh, turn them on during rainy days okay so that is easier for the driver to see what is in front all right because when it's raining heavily it's very hard for the driver to see so this windshield can help okay can help to make it clearer for the driver to see. Who did not turn off your microphone? Okay, so aside from this windshield, we also have mirror. Uh, we have rear mirror, we have front mirror, okay, for the car. So this mirror must be made, uh, must be made up from material that are non-water absorbent. Because when we go to sit inside our car, we want to protect ourselves from rain. So, our car door, our mirror, okay, uh, the front mirror, uh, the side mirror or the back mirror. Everything. Must, yeah, must be made up from material that are non-water absorbent so that the water cannot pass through. Uh, okay, so for our class today, for our class today, okay, this is the worksheet that you have to do in Seesaw. Okay, this is the worksheet that you have to do in seesaw. But listen to teacher first. Listen to teacher first so that you will know what to do. Okay, so teacher asked you the importance. Uh, please turn off the microphone. Teacher asked you about the importance. Okay, importance of this following object. So the first one, uh, the first one. Asma, can Asma tell teacher what is this Asma Safiya? Uh. Rain? Rain what? I don't know that yet. You don't know this one? No. No, it's not okay. Yeah, I know. Ah, okay, what is your cut Rain suit. Rain suit. Rain suit or rain coat. Rain coat. Uh, rain suit. Okay. <laughs> All right. So this one, okay. Rain coat. Mm, people use the rain coat to protect themselves from what? Why do we need to have the rain coat? Rain. 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 That uh, you say the windshield just now huh. is the wiper. Yes. Wiper. Yes. Ah, okay. So wait, eh? Teacher, teacher, this one. Yeah, it's a wiper. Okay, teacher, erase. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, erase. I will label again. It's a wiper. Ah, Ian, how to spell Ian? W I P E R. W I P E R. I knew it. So, so where, where should the teacher label the wiper? Where should the teacher label the wiper? The bottom. <laughs> the bottom of the arrow. 
Where should this label the wiper? The bottom of the arrow. Ah, this one. Okay, this one wiper. Wiper. Okay. Ah, so this one, the big mirror. Ah, uh, you don't have to turn on the microphone to shout or make random noise. Okay, just answer question that teacher asks you. All right. All right. So, uh, once again, if you turn on your microphone and make random more uh, noise, okay, I will remove you from class. Uh, teacher want all of you to hear my explanation clearly. So, only turn on your microphone when teacher asks you a question or when I call your name. Okay, so this one is windshield. Thank you, Ian. Windshield. Okay. Uh, all right. Uh, windshield. Okay, so the big mirror here is the windshield. The small here is the wiper. Okay. Uh, sorry, teacher got confused. <laughs> Thank you, Ian. Okay, so... This one is the raincoat, all right? Teacher don't want you to answer. Teacher don't want you to answer rain only. Or teacher don't want you to write raincoat. I'm asking you the importance. The importance of the raincoat. So you need to answer to protect ourselves from what? Okay, raincoat, what we can, what the raincoat can from do. From the earth. rain, from the snow. Ah, so you can write here later in seesaw, all right? So this one, we have tissue. Okay, the second one, we have tissue. So for tissue, what do we use our tissue for? What do we use our tissue for? To absorb water. To absorb water, okay. If you want to... To absorb water where? Table. Ah, from table. Or to wipe, uh, to wipe your hand. Teacher. Or to wipe your face. It's up to you lah what you want to answer here. Teacher. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, how okay. to spell protect? Protect. P-R-O. P-R-O. T-E. T-E. T-T. T-T. What? T-T. T-T. Protect. Okay. Mm. okay. So this one, this one you can do later. As for now, we are going to do our activity book first together. Okay, this one you can do later in Seesaw. So, can you open your activity book, everyone? Uh, Piwa Osman and Piwan Ali haven't done page... Wait, eh? Uh, page 51 haven't done yet. Right. 51. No, no. Not yet. Not yet. Sorry, that has you can wait to see. 51. 51. Yes, you can. Uh, 51. 51. Yes. Okay. Thank you. 51. 51. 